son of a Colorado congresswoman, Lauren Boebert, has been arrested and charged with nearly two dozen crimes, including multiple felonies. The 18-year-old is accused of breaking into vehicles and then stealing wallets. Fox 31's Ashley Michaels is live in studio tonight with the very latest Ashley. Well, police arrested Tyler Boebert yesterday. He's already been in court and released, but he's still facing some very serious charges. Now, according to arrest documents, he's accused of playing a role in breaking into at least four vehicles in the rifle area, then using stolen debit cards. The purchases were mostly at gas stations for things like fuel, snacks, even a blue Gatorade. There was also a $50 charge at McDonald's and a charge for more than 700 bucks at an online clothing shop that got flagged and declined. Now we're told this uh, happened uh, when he was with a group of friends, so it's unclear exactly who did what in this string of crimes. But police identified Tyler using security cameras from the gas stations. So you can see it here in this photo. It's tough to see, but he was wearing a hoodie that said Shooter's Grill on it. That's the restaurant his mom, Congresswoman Lauren Boebert, used to own. Now in a statement, she said in part, I love my son who's been through some very difficult public challenges that he didn't ask for. Breaks my heart to see my child struggling and that he should be held accountable for poor decisions just like any other citizen. Now, this is the latest in a string of legal trouble for the Bobert family. Recently, there were accusations of a physical fight between the congresswoman and her ex-husband. She did end up filing a temporary restraining order against him. Now, she has said that is one of the big reasons why she moved from the Western Slope to Windsor, Colorado instead, and why she is currently running for Colorado's 4th Congressional District instead of CD3, which is the seat that she currently holds. Ashley Michaels, Fox 31. All right, Ashley, thank you very much.